so we can do it in the cartoon. So here's a very rotted 1971 Cuda. This car, as you can see from these arrows, the top has either been replaced or cut, I'm not totally sure. There's all these little spots on it. But this car is not for sale. Um, this Cuda belongs to a friend and there's a motor that's in it that is not original to the car that we want to take out. This 71 Cuda has a 413 motor and come to find out that steering column there doesn't go to the car either. Um, we tried it out and it did not work. But this uh, 413 we're taking out of this car. We've got it for a separate project and we're going to get that one started for a 1963 Plymouth Fury Super Commando that you can see pictured here. This is one you've seen on previous videos that we got out of Chico, California. So this car right now we're checking out to see if it will steer or not. Uh, apparently not. Come so on. Ryan's the steering at the moment. Uh, twisting that knuckle back and forth and me trying to go slow enough that I don't injure my friend since fourth grade. Should be a pretty smooth takeout. This car has been sitting forever. I have no idea if this motor will work or not. It does turn as Ryan's spinning it right now and it turns no problem. Should be a pretty easy pull. Um, he's got it all loosened up, ready to come out. We're just gonna pull the engine and transmission simultaneously out of this car and hopefully not back into the barn at the same time. Yeah, I think we got it. So this car, I'll show you some close up pictures of it here at the end, but it definitely has some rot. So this was a upper east car back in the day and then it's been sitting here in California probably at least 20 years, I'm not really sure. But stay tuned, watch more on this 413 getting rebuilt for our 1963 Plymouth Fury. Uh, like and subscribe for more content from Rough and Ready Rides.